from Happier Home. Hello. Thank you, Lisa. Thank you for having me here today. I'm very excited to bring our business model to you. Um, I was actually talking to someone today from Missouri, and he was telling me about how there was a home care company in his town, and they were asking him and his pharmacies for referrals of his clients that are coming into his pharmacy to his home care or to their home care companies. So he began referring that to the outside home care company. Well, they turned around and they opened their own community pharmacies. So not only did he give his potential referrals to his own company away, they started competition against him. So I'm bringing you today a way that you could expand into home and community-based services and utilize your pharmacy as a referral source for your own company. As a happier at home franchise owner, you will increase your business revenue by expanding into home and community-based services. Take Bill, for example. Bill currently owns a pharmacy in Michigan. His community and customers trust him and his pharmacy. Bill knows that becoming a franchise owner of Happier at Home is a strategy for growth. Bill can now offer services to customers to help them remain in their home and independent. He keeps his customers safely at home, maintaining his customer base, and develops a private pay source of revenue. Likewise, his Happier at Home business is a feeder for new customers to his pharmacy from his home care clients. His pharmacy has a natural connection with his senior customers that he already knows well. Bill has now established his pharmacy and his Happier at Home franchise as the authority in senior care in his community. The community knows that they can depend on Bill as the one-stop shop for all their needs. Bill knows that with the unmatched support, processes, marketing materials, social media marketing, and so much more, he can develop his home care business and hit the ground running. Seems like a no-brainer, right? Um, so, let's see if I can get my slides up here. Oh, no. So, um, with uh, Happier at Home, uh, some benefits to you in expanding are that it's a strategy for growth. So you always have to be thinking and striving for growth or you're going to be failing, especially with inflation. So another reason that having a happier at home business is that it's a private pay source of revenue. So we're talking about cash source of revenue where health insurances are not dictating your prices for your patients. As a franchisor, we're going to provide all the training for you and the processes, everything that you need. But um, you won't have to deal with the health insurances. Of course, we're, there we go, we're one of the Alzheimer's Association's preferred providers. Uh, we have contracts with them. There are different ways that we will help you to determine how to uh, bill your patients. But by large, it's it's a cash basis. So I'm going to walk down here because I have to get my glasses on. Um, as far as the product, uh, when you're a happier home business owner, the services that you'll provide would include uh, non medical home care. So we don't want to get into the nursing care where then you would have to pay for medical malpractice insurance and that type of thing. But you would do things that will help people to remain in their homes and independent. That might be things like light housekeeping, meal planning and preparation, reminding them to take their medications, um, transportation, and things like that. In some states, and we will guide you on this, some states you're able to do personal assistance services. So it's just a little bit of a higher level of care uh, where you're doing some bathing and uh, activities of daily living as well. Additionally, another line of service that you would have as a business owner is care advocacy or sometimes called care management, depending on which state you're in as well. Um, the fourth line of business is really medication administration solutions within the home. 
And this is another place that we really work hand in hand with our pharmacy owners that are our franchisees to make sure that you're growing your pharmacy business as a result of your home care business as well. So the benefits of expanding, I started to tell you earlier, earlier are um, as a strategy for growth um, with that private pay source of revenue. Um, in uh, Rochester, New York, where I started my original location about 16 years ago, um, we developed a great reputation for happier at home. I go on our local news channel once a week, um, talk about senior care issues, caregiving issues, and really want to show our franchisees how to become the authority for senior care within your community. So then you already have a respected re reputation in your community. You have doctors, um, transitional care units, all kinds of people that really depend on you as that authority for senior care. So why would they not then refer their clients or patients to you to take care of them within their home as well? So as the video also explained, that this serves as a feeder for the programs in your pharmacy as well. So if you're doing immunization programs, you could do that in the home for your patients. If you're uh, doing compliance packaging, why not have all of your patients that are in home care providing or using your compliance packaging? And then you have your caregivers to remind them to take those medications. So all of these different ways, and there are different programs that we uh, have worked with our franchisees uh, to develop. And we do have a good number of pharmacy owners that are franchisees. We actually have someone in the audience that signed a franchise agreement yesterday that we've been talking with, um, and very excited to get them going as well. Uh, this also, as you know, our whole point is to enable seniors to remain in their homes and as independent as possible. So by enabling the seniors to remain in their homes, you're keeping your customer base. They're not moving on to assisted living or nursing homes. And so you're, you're kind of keeping your senses or keeping your customer base from moving on. Um, also, it helps to reduce readmissions to hospitals. This is a big pain point for those in the healthcare continuum with health insurance. If you are in the hospital post-op uh, or post-hospital uh, stay, once you're discharged, if you leave, and then come back into the emergency department within 30 days of your discharge, it causes all of those healthcare providers along the continuum to lose money. So you're providing a solution of a safe discharge home for them without any cost to them, but you're saving them money. So they would want to be referring to you as, as well. So of course, we all love to increase medication compliance. That's one of I guess the biggest cause of people going into nursing homes and having hospital stays. So as a result of your programs, in combination with the happier at home caregivers, with the medication reminders, you'll be able to do that. So why choose happier at home? There are other companies out there that franchise and do this. Well, we work exclusively now with um, pharmacy owners, community pharmacy owners. We have a couple of franchisees that started out with us initially when we started franchising and they're doing great, but the pharmacy owners do incredibly well and they do well very quickly. Um, one of the things that I'm very happy about, proud about with Happier at Home is that we have great marketing materials. So as a franchisee, you'll have all of your marketing materials developed with the Happier at Home branding. And we have the trademark and design mark of Happier at Home. So in your territory, no one could use that name of Happier at Home with a home care company. So if also you want any other marketing materials developed, we work and make sure that we do that for you. But we keep the brand consistent for um, the integrity for all of our franchises. Uh, another reason to choose Happier at Home is that you have multiple lines of private pay business. So this is really important. Um, 
obviously, because it's the name of this entire conference, Diversify. Diversify your services and private pay in combination with that. You're, you're really helping yourself on the business aspect to um, use that as a strategy for growth. Um, we have excellent training and support. I enjoy it. It's one of my passions to share our business model with people and with companies to grow their company. So um, we have, from the time you sign your franchise agreement, pre-training activities. So we get you ready for training, which is one week in Rochester, New York. And then after the training, continued support. Um, we're available 24-7 for questions. Um, email, text, we have programs where we're doing um, continued trainings for our franchisees and monthly franchisee phone calls where all of us get on uh, actual Zoom conferences together. We talk about our successes, we talk about our challenges, and see if there's anything that people are asking of us as the franchisor, or if, there's, uh, if there are new ideas and things like that. So we have a great family. Um, also, the Happier at Home League. I uh, mentioned that Happier at Home is trademarked and design marked um, across the country. But I have to say, when we have uh, customers, our patients, come to us and they found our name on a list that when they were given, when they were, di when they were discharged from the hospital or from a rehab facility, they scan down the list and they see the name Happier at Home and they love it. It's really what people want to do. They just want to remain happier at home and not move on to uh, long-term care facilities. Also, our company is run with low overhead. We run it very lean. We teach you how to do the same thing. Uh, if you have an office space or a room within your pharmacy, you can use that as your base or your office for happier at home. Uh, and so we will talk to you about those expenses if you're interested in, in talking with us further, but definitely low overhead. And one of the greatest things we do is that we manage the social media marketing and the content for all of our franchisees. We, uh, well, as I mentioned, I go on TV and our local news channel every week, and we have video content that uh, we're able to post onto your website develop your Happier at Home website. So we're able to post that and drive your search engine optimization um, with all of our social media marketing between Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and LinkedIn. It really increases your exposure and uh, we take care of all of that for you. So if you're interested in learning more, I know we left some postcards on the table. You're able to scan that and submit to get more information. Uh, also on the back of my business card that is on your table is also the scanner for the same thing. And um, check us out at happierandhomefranchise.com. I would love to talk to all of you and thank you so much for listening. Debbie, I know a couple of her franchisees are very happy.